missing there when the incident occurred. Window net coming down of Tyler. Such a strong start to the season for Tyler. He's had nothing but bad luck here lately. Bit of a bounce back last week at North Wilkesboro, but the problems today had to spin in qualifying, tried to come from the rear, and unfortunately not going to have the ending he wanted. It hasn't been for a lack of speed. They just had a bad lot. Three finishes, 20th or worse, going into last week at North Wilkesboro. Could we tell stage three started, guys? Tetsi definitely picked up a little bit right here. Just like last year, you go stage one, stage two, caution free. You get in the final stage, all bets are off. And as you said, a little more aggression. And we have our first caution for an accident on the night. See Jeffrey in there moving around, getting ready to climb out of that truck. What a tough break for him, right? See if we can see where this starts. Oh, it didn't. It's already well happened. Yeah, anchor it was, was way down there. Yeah, that's strange. Bad Moffitt coming in, nowhere to go, really landed in his lap here. Yeah, Ankrum comes straight up the racetrack right in front of Bad Moffat in the 46. So that is a bunch of hard hits for these guys. Look at all the damage to the I'm front of to. that truck of Bad Moffat and the right side of Ankrum's truck. My imagination is, 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 is running wild trying to figure out why he was so low if he was hooked or a flat tire or something bad right there. Didn't have anywhere to go. Saw Keith McGee come in and make contact. Check out the middle right, of the pack. Here we go, right here. Tyler Ankrum. Oh, he gets, he gets hooked. Yeah, he went to move up the track a little bit, and there was someone there. Was Brett that Brett Moffitt? Yep. And then watch this. Moffitt, mm. that Moffitt had committed to the...